So, I haven't decided when I'm going to cut this video yet, so if you're still hearing this. Let's do, uh... I'll just cut to the next video with an intro to say... Yeah, uh, this is going to be a montage episode. We're going to tackle all the Coliseums in order in case you missed the last episode. Yada, yada, yada. Uh, I guess I'll show on screen now me going to get as many revives as I can. But uh, levels will be different after the montage episode. So if you want to skip that one, come back to this and have me see me have a crack at Evis again, then uh, we can definitely try that. Mount Battle is also an option for the record. But, uh, it's gonna take a long time to get to, get all the way through it, and the early stages of it are just like level 20s and stuff, so, uh, levels for that place will be harder to achieve. I'll say that much. Alright, uh... So, if we're going to Finex City first, let's see if they actually have revives there. Alright, okay, Finex right here. Zoom. I actually can't use Heracross in this uh, bout, so what I should do first is uh, purify him. Now, how would I go about doing that if not going to Pyrite Town first and doing the Coliseum Challenge there? Oh, it doesn't even have, uh, revives. Oh, you know what, actually? Let's go to the, uh, the Pyrite Building and just walk through there for a bit. That way we can get, uh, we can get Heracross all purified by the end of it. Do -do -do -do. Agate Village. Wait, wrong place. That's not Pyrite Town. I had purification on the brain, so I'm like, all right, that's what I'm going to do. You can tell whenever something goes awry, uh, my concentration is uh, thrown out of whack. But hey, at least we get to listen to a jam. Do you have revives? Sure do hope so. Sure do so. All right, yeah, I can only get four. Hilarious. Okay, dokie. Pyrite building? Rui. God damn. I actually don't know when I would have cut the Evis fight. Like, if I would have started the video with it or ended it. I'm assuming it would have been near the end of a fight. Um. So there's that. Also, I'm remembering. Hey, look, I have Blizzard. So what I'm gonna do is toss that onto shoot. And get rid of Aurora Beam. Bada bing. Alright. Up the building. So, yeah, I don't remember when I would have cut the... Or I don't know, rather. How, how can I remember something if I haven't done it yet? Uh... So... Yeah. If earlier in this video I uh, fought Evis and lost, then the rest of this video is just going to be me trying to get uh, Heracross in a purification state. If I didn't, then that's what this whole video is. So, like, it's either last video that I did something with Evis, or it's this video where... Uh, this is happening. But yeah, if you want to stick around, hang out, we can do that. Talk to me. What's your favorite part of the game so far? If not the playthrough, then the uh, the game itself, the play of the game. And if you were to play this game, if you haven't before... Actually, no. Same goes for people who have played it. What would be or what is your Pokemon team of the Shadow Pokemon you've seen? Because unless you transfer your own Pokemon in, uh, you can't really use anything besides the Shadow Pokemon that have shown up in the game so far. Would you try to go with Pokemon that you know are really good, like, I don't know, Quagsire or... Uh, 
I guess Heracross. Um, the legendaries. Or would you go for some of the more offshoot type Pokemon? And no pun intended on the shoot, by the way, I just realized that. Um, I had another thought regarding Shadow Pokemon. I'm trying to remember it right now. It already escaped me. The thought already escaped me. That's a good sign. I guess another question, uh, to those who have played this, how would you rank it among all the other Pokemon games you have played, spin-offs or otherwise? Personally, I think this is one of my favorites in terms of aesthetic. Gameplay-wise, maybe not really high, that high up there, but aesthetically, yeah, it's, it's great. Whoa, whoa, whoa! There he goes. Uh, endure. Uh, Thunderbolt. Oh no, Heracross might end up dying. Ah, ah, ah. I don't think I have any more cologne in my cologne case, do I? We got a joy and excite. How about you? What's your heart gauge gonna be after this? Also, I just realized Heracross is adamant nature. That's really good. Because that increases attack and lower special attack. Yeah, the scents aren't doing anything. Pokemon looking for the chance to go wild! Uh, we'll do this and this. Of course it did. Very angry boy. Very adamant boy. By which I mean Heracross, not anybody else. Oop, there he goes. Alright, Heracross, get out of that. And we'll send in Snooze. Is that going to hit Pupitar Underground? I can never remember if Magnitude also hit Underground Pokemon. Ta! All 
Alright, that notch is still not quite there yet, so... A little bit more persuasion, or at least one more sending out into battle, and then he could actually have a strong move. Hey! What's up, Hyper Mode? Haven't seen you in forever. Ah! Ah! Wow, bodied. Even he had the very cartoony <laughs> sound effect. Heracross! Now, does it get Brick Break or Mega Horn? I think it gets Brick Break. I don't actually remember when it's supposed to get Mega Horn. Go have a look at Heracross Gen 3. Heracross Gen. Nope. Gen 3 learn set. There it is. Megahorn is learned at level 53, so, you know, a few levels from now. Alright, Remorated Magnemite, I think we've got this. Probably, if I had to guess. Whammo. <laughs> Builder Achman. If he was female, do you think he'd be Achwomen? That's okay, I'll take the stunning silence as a way of saying don't say that ever again. Running for the bug. I mean, to be fair, the only other thing on the field is something that resists the electric move, so. Makes sense to me. Forehead beam! but okay. Shadow Rush again for that... Okay, it didn't actually trigger that time. I was hoping for Hyper Mode one more time just so I could, you know, call him next round. Uh... This wasn't good enough. This is a dilemma. It's a $12 word right there. You gotta watch what you're saying. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll continue on. Come and get some. Bloody, and I have one of them. Uh, how's about uh, this? 
Well, you know what? Why did I expect anything different, really? And zoop. A bird. Are you telling me Ledian's physical attack is garbage? Who would have thought? Goes again. Oh, I was really hoping it would hit three times. Oh well. Doesn't matter what I use. Gonna die anyway. Boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Hoche doche. So I can do it like one or two more battles with Heracross before it's able to be purified. In which case, I'm just gonna go back down, heal my Pokemon, go outside, fight someone in the right in the dual square, and then uh, hopefully that'll get the heart gauge all the way down. Maybe, possibly, debatably. We haven't fought this dude in a while. Will you fight? Yeah. He, had, he was the guy who had the Slugma. I know more. Oop, we're almost there. And survey says we are there. No more need to be using uh, Shadow Rush for Hyper Mode. Wallop him! In victory! Punch that camel! Then slap a camel, because it could be your only chance. All right, and we're done. Wrap it up. Beat him up. I didn't know Pyrite Town was having a thunderstorm. That's weird. Well, that should be a sign for me to go find a a, um, a PC to save the game just in case something wrong goes wrong. You know, it's something wrong turning out to be right. You know, that's what that means when something wrong goes wrong. Alright, let's go heal. Uh, heal. Purify. Agate Village, once again. Can I trap Rui? There we go. Alright, see ya, lady. 
unfortunately, as soon as we transition, well, she found her way anyway, apparently. But yeah, uh, as soon as we transition, she would just come right back to us. Heracross, what am I gonna name you? I do not know. Ding. Also, a ribbon, because that's not enough experience to level up again. Uh, hmm. Thinking like synonyms for breaking or maiming or something like that. But specifically like a verb. It uh, goes against the idea I have of it being a single syllable or like monosyllabic or two syllable verb, but pulverize, I think, is a good way of uh, describing what Heracross can do. Plus, it was a lot more complicated getting him purified than anything else, so why not have a more complicated name? Okay, so now that's done. Next video will be a montage episode. We're gonna be fighting the Colosseums that I, uh, like the rounds of the Colosseums that I haven't done before. And, uh, we'll be getting some neat TMs out of it, too, so that's incentive enough to, uh, to want to watch it. Oh, hang on, let me try to get Rui to, uh, get trapped right there. Nope. There we go. Alright, have fun, girl.